so even this becomes 2 so now we have successfully completed this table and now we know how to work with reaction mechanisms and rate equations together so uh, now we have completed reaction mechanisms and we will be studying catalysis uh, for the rest of the presentation so catalysis basically the process uh, in which a catalyst speeds up a reaction so if you go back to my uh, my playlist on rates of reaction uh, then I have defined what homogeneous and heterogeneous catalysis is so right now we are doing homogeneous catalysis and homogeneous catalysis occurs when the catalyst is in the same phase as the reactants so um, for example in esterification uh, so I have given the example of esterification over here but I'll give you an uh, so for, I'll give you the equation so an alcohol so let's take ethanol CH3 CH2 CO2H ethanol is uh, so, uh, sorry this is not ethanol this is propanoic acid so let's just take propanoic acid so propanoic acid aqueous plus ethanol which is CH3 CH2OH aqueous now these two combine to give us an ester and they also release water so when these two combine we get in a reversible reaction we get CH3 CH2 CO2 CH2 CH3 so this is ethyl propanoate so ethyl because two carbons over here and propanoate because three carbons over here so ethyl propanoate plus H2O plus H2O so the catalyst use is aqueous H plus ions for this reaction so as you can see the carboxylic acid is aqueous the alcohol is aqueous and the H plus ions are aqueous so all of the, the catalyst is in the same phase as the reactants so H so sulfuric acid I've just written H plus over here but sulfuric acid is a homogeneous catalyst, catalyst in this case so this reaction proceeds via homogeneous catalysis because the catalyst is in the same phase as the reactants so there is a specific example of homogeneous catalysis in our A level syllabus which is where, uh, so let me just write the reaction first and then I'll give you the, the, the example so S2O8 2 negative plus 2I negative gives I2 plus okay this will be a reversible reaction because uh, I'll tell you why why this reaction will not do the completion so this will be a reversible reaction and uh, I2 plus 2 SO4 sulfate ion 2 negative so now if you see it's balanced on both sides and this is a reaction in which S2O8 2 negative ions react with iodide ions to give iodine and sulfate ions so now this reaction is very slow and it also does not go to completion because if you see this is negatively charged and this is negatively charged so we know that when like charges come together they repel like charges repel opposite charges attract like charges repel so since both of them are negatively charged they will repel each other so they will not react very fast the reaction will be so slow since they will be repelling each other so uh, all of these are in aqueous state so I am not writing aqueous in front of all of them but you will have to write it in your exam but I am not doing that so aqueous phase they are all of them are in aqueous phase and the catalyst used is Fe2 plus aqueous ions so as you can see it's a homogeneous catalyst and as it is a homogeneous catalyst it uh, it is uh, and it's a homogeneous catalyst because it is aqueous and or and these reagents are in, are in aqueous state or aqueous phase sorry 
So Fe2 plus is in aqueous phase and the reagents are in aqueous phase. So um, this is a